wanted to give you an update on the homicide that we sent out for the press release last night. Uh, last night, or yesterday afternoon around 2 p.m., officers were dispatched to the 5800 block of North Gold Nugget Avenue for a stabbing. Um, as a result of the investigation from yesterday afternoon, um, Joseph Dang Mamat, and I will spell the first name as J-O-S-E-P-H, D-E-N-G, last name is M-A-M-O-T. He's a 50-year-old male and his date of birth is 1-1 of 1970. Uh, last night at pro approximately 6.30 p.m. he was taken into custody for uh, numerous charges that um, Lincoln, or Minnehaha County State's Attorney is going to come up and explain to you here in a little bit. Um, what we do know is, is they're in a domestic relationship, they're known to each other. Uh, a verbal altercation ensued. Uh, during that verbal altercation, uh, we believe, I have reason to believe that Mr. Mamat uh, used a knife and stabbed the victim, a coat modder is her name. She's a 39-year-old female numerous times. And she was pronounced deceased at the scene. Maybe you have a spell? Yes. Last name is M-A-T-E-R. First name is A-K-O-A-T. Um, during the incident, Mr. Mamat was injured as well. He was taken to the hospital for some medical treatment. That injury was a result of the altercation that took, took place between the two of them. And after that, he was brought to the police department where we spoke to him. Um, we did also executed or collected evidence at the scene, obviously and from his person. I can't give specific details on what evidence that is, but we did collect evidence and we believe this is the, he's the individual responsible for her murder and that's why he's in jail currently. Do you have any questions on anything off on that right now? Okay. Perfect. Um, we worked all through the night and as she has since 2005 with us, Crystal Johnson, the Minneapolis County State's Attorney, worked with us, works with us on every homicide. Um, I always give, in the briefings, I always tell you that there's reasons I can't say things. So today I invited uh, Crystal Johnson down for that reason, that she can speak to the charges with you folks and give you more information that she deems that is necessary to give out. So I'd like to introduce Crystal Johnson, Minneapolis County State's Attorney. Good morning. Uh, my name is Crystal Johnson. I'm the Minnehaha County State's Attorney. Uh, this morning we filed uh, charging documents on Joseph Dang Mamat uh, for charge of murder in the first degree, which we would typically know as premeditated murder. And then in the alternative, we have charged him with murder in the second degree, and then two counts of manslaughter in the first degree. Murder in the first degree is a class A felony, which is punishable by life or death. Uh, murder in the second degree is a class B felony, which is punishable by life. And then manslaughter in the first degree is a class C felony, which is punishable by up to life. He will be scheduled for court today at 1.30 in courtroom 1A. Any questions about the charges that he is facing? Yeah, specifically first degree. Because it sounds as if this was an alleged verbal altercation. Yes. I'm wondering about the degree of planning. So uh, what's the South Dakota uh, state law and case law requires is that for premeditation there is no time frame that has to be required for time frame for determining premeditation they don't require that there's minutes or even seconds and then what uh, our law requires is that premeditation can be formed in an instant that uh, determination was made to uh, end somebody's life do you plan to pursue all charges to the fullest extent uh, at this point it's too early to say um, but we're gathering that evidence, and as the case goes on, we will make that determination. I want to extend our thanks to the Sioux Falls Police Department. They, again, work diligently and uh, handled a very difficult case in a very timely manner. And we're always, as the state's attorney's office, always very appreciative to work with such an excellent law enforcement base. Any other questions? Okay. 